Begin in a comfortable squat stance with one kettlebell racked in the overhead position. While holding the kettlebell in the overhead position, take a deep breath in to brace your core and initiate your squat with your hips, bringing your hips down to a comfortable depth. You should be actively retracting your shoulder on the same side that's holding the kettlebell to keep your bicep next to your head and your wrist stacked on top of your shoulder. Treat your foot as a tripod having a sturdy base in the heel of your foot and the other two points of contact are at the base of your big toe and pinky toe. Once you've reached full depth, make sure to drive through the heel of your foot to go back to the top of the squat. Maintaining an upright posture is a big key component to be able to do this exercise correctly. If somebody is having a hard time maintaining that upright posture, it can come from a lack of mobility or range of motion in the ankles. You can fix this by elevating the heels with something like the handles of the kettlebell to provide more room for dorsiflexion to help maintain that upright position. If somebody is having a hard time with the overhead position or has limited mobility in their upper back, you can modify the one kettlebell to one hand to both hands. This will allow a little more freedom to have the kettlebell out in front of you and use it as a counterweight as you sit back onto your heels. You can also modify this exercise by using a foam roller. By doing so, this will allow you to understand the concept of holding something with both hands in an overhead position and actively work your upper back as you're performing your overhead squat. 